Let us now understand CI and CD in a very very basic ways in terms of the stages and the environment. So let us suppose we have these three very basic typical stages in any project that is build, test and deploy. We also have a release stage but for now let us look at these three basic stages. When we talk about CI or continuous integration then CI expands from the build stage until some part of the testing stage because here we are doing the integration of the code and then after a successful build and code integration we also run some unit tests within the dev environment and can also run some functional test from the QA environment to make sure that our integration the integrated code is now working and there are no errors or no issues so CI expands from the build to some part of the test stage. If I talk about CD that is continuous delivery, it includes the CI process and then we also deploy it on a pre-prod or a staging environment. So here the continuous delivery process will expand until the deployment stage. And now when we talk about continuous deployment in CD or continuous deployment, we do CI and CD that is continuous delivery plus we also do deployment on the actual production environment so here we can say that we are also doing the release of our software to the final production environment so cd or continuous deployment process will expand until the release stage now if i also include the environments that is the dev environment the qa the staging and the production environment now the CI process will expand until the QA environment, the CD or the continuous delivery process will extend until the pre-production or the staging environment and then the continuous deployment process will extend until the final production environment. So this is in the very very basic ways. This chart you can keep it in your minds forever and this is the complete process of CI and CD. And when all these processes of CI CD are integrated with each other with an automatic trigger that is once the CI process is complete and successful it will trigger the CD process or the deployment process when the deployment process is complete and successful it will then trigger the release process and all these are automated and the complete pipeline is automated this is called as the CI CD pipeline. I hope this was useful for you. Thank you for watching.